There's nothing like coming home from school or work, firing up your console of choice, and settling in for your nightly gaming session of Fortnite. That is until you find out you are banned and panic mode sets in. While I do think some of these kids throwing fits is pretty funny, not everyone deserves the ban hammer. I mean, there is kids who think it's the funniest thing in the world to scream into their microphone and to outright cheat just so they can brag to their friends in school the next day and feel better about themselves. And unfortunately, these kids aren't going to go away anytime soon. But thankfully, Epic knows how to deal with what is arguably the worst thing about online gaming. Number 5. While killing teammates is definitely one way to get your account banned, glitching is just one notch above that offense. But it's certainly just as old. From trying to find ways to unfairly fly or teleport around the map, to this instance of kids going under the map and just waiting it out until their last one's remaining and winning by an unfair default. Glitching in Fortnite takes the fun away from not only the cheaters, but to the other players as well. And in the end, when Epic bans kids for doing this, you just gotta wonder, was it really worth it for them to use a glitch just so they could brag to their friends about it at lunchtime? I guess a Fortnite player street cred of how many games they've won goes a long way in middle school nowadays. Number 4. This kid playing Fortnite received a temporary 5 day ban after he was caught teaming with enemy players. An offense similar to that of his adult professional gaming counterpart, Zacubus. Yet, what more of a mature way for this kid to vent about breaking the rules and trying to earn pity points than by going on a snapchat rant using a filter that made his mouth look like he got stung by the furies of mini bees. I'm sure his parents must be proud. Number 3. Sometimes a good prank goes a long way to teach a lesson. And in the case of popular online gamer King Kenny, that's exactly what happened after his little brother went on a tirade that included smashing a bottle over Kenny's head. And while that part seems staged, Kenny's little brother's legitimate reaction to logging onto Fortnite only to find that he'd been banned for aggressive behavior, despite not realizing that it was a video his brother made to fool him, only made the prank that much more admirable, as we finally get to see sweet justice inflicted upon his brother. To quote J. Walter Weatherman from Arrested Development, that's why you never smash a glass bottle over your older brother's head. Number 2. Who knew that by cheating in a game that you could end up getting sued by its developer? Well, that's exactly what happened to a 14 year old kid who would live stream and brag about cheating while playing Fortnite Battle Royale. Yup, instant headshot again. Oh, no, he, and he just shot at somebody that you couldn't even see. Uh, yup, another one. Another one? Yeah, he's 100% cheating oh my god which was evidence enough for epic games themselves to lob a hundred fifty thousand dollar lawsuit that kid's way but is this a case of epic going too far though would a simple ban suffice as a parent how do you even begin to react to that kids are supposed to get in trouble for cheating while taking a test in school not while playing a mind-numbing video game no one grounds their kids for that and at least they didn't used to what a time to be alive power to the player i guess number one popular youtuber the new adam b99 Known for his videos which include pranks, outdoes King Kenny by making his own little brother Callum think that he's been perma-banned from Fortnite Battle Royale. Sneaking into Callum's room when he's walked away after firing up the game and waiting for it to load, Adam puts a USB drive into his little brother's PS4 and opens up a photoshopped image that says Callum's account has been banned due to cheating. From there, chaos ensues for his little brother as he walks back into his room, sees the image, I didn't cheat. Callum, did you cheat? No, I don't know why you cheat. Well, they don't buy me for nothing. I don't know. I didn't cheat. You must have cheated, Kim. I haven't cheated. What did you do? Did you, did you get banned? What, what cheating did you do? I hope you don't do anything bad. I didn't. You do know that this means you can't play Fortnite ever again. Ever. And has a meltdown of confusion and anger as his older brother captures it all on film. Including him rolling around his bed trying to figure out just what cheat he did to get him kicked off Fortnite for good. It's all in good fun though, as Adam shows Callum in the end that it was merely all a prank, and he can log back into the game and continue to have fun, up until the next prank his older brother pulls on him. Like maybe switching the PS4 for one that will self-destruct after he loads up Fortnite. 